Good morning. Little pumpkin. And another little pumpkin. Hope everybody is doing all right this morning. And wow, do we have some loud chirping going on this morning. That's a little much. I wonder if there's a cat over there. Probably. All right, let's get to it. Let's have a great day. There is my pumpkin babies in the pumpkin patch and in the grass. And then I have a nice path here. All right, some apple trees. My greenhouse that's falling apart, but I have new plastic for it. But have I put it on? No. Have I sanded and painted? No. I did manage to kill these this quart grass though. And here's my super secret pumpkin. She is doing whatever she wants, and I just weeded yesterday, which was nice. I got all the grass and the sedge, whatever is going around there. So, she, she's, um, she's got a female flower today. Huh, I don't know if there's any males about, but maybe we should take care of that. I didn't even think that she would have a female by now. I thought I saw one, but since I was weeding, I was busy. I wasn't thinking. Let me see. Is there, there's one male in there. Huh. Maybe we will go pollinate her. Be back. I didn't even see you, Maggie. <laughs> Where is he? There's Maggie <laughs> watching me. Hi, Maggie. You're so pretty. She's a fire bloober um, and a very small plant, but you know, she can do whatever she wants over here. I'm just going to allow it. I'll allow it. All right. On the vine with the pumpkin that is, uh, well, the vine is cracked. You can see her. Sneaky right there. She has another female. But it looks like there's a honeybee in there. Not really doing much. Maybe she's enjoying herself. So I did it. I cut out the broken vine, pumpkin, and most of her vine. I left a couple of giant leaves, and I moved over the tiniest vine, and she has a pumpkin on her. It's gonna be maybe a couple days, and we'll see. I moved her closer to the path. So she's got a little bit of room to grow. The malformed flower, this is like DAP one, I guess. I took the petals off because they were soggy and weird. So I moved her vine a little bit and then the one that I like took her petal off, petals off too because also soggy and weird. Um, 
I'm not sure what those are. I'm looking over there. Anyway, I gotta trim this grass. It's not really grass, it's combat regulation, lawn green, whatever. Anyway, I moved her vine. Um, everything's moved over nicely. A lot now, so she has lots of room here. I mean, this post is just a temporary bamboo post to hold up the shade cloth, but you know, that can go. And we can have lots of room here, and that's okay. And then the tertiary that <laughs> is coming out here has a pumpkin on it too. She's really far off, but you know, at this point, since I don't really have a fruit going, I don't know, we don't know about them yet, I'm not cutting anybody off. I am just gonna let her ride. Those two, we'll see how it goes. I got one coming in a couple of days, we'll see how that goes. Lots of plant to support them. Um, so, that's the haps. Everybody got watered today. Uh, they got an uh, insecticide two days ago, so we're we're doing all right. Got up to like 86 here in the patch. Very sunny, very nice day. So, God willing, those will be bigger tomorrow, and we can tell if they have taken. Hopefully, they're gonna rock and roll, and we're gonna have. A baby. Alright, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe because I think that's what I'm supposed to say. Alright, bye. Bonus. A bonus pumpkin plant. Who Butters is actually guarding and protecting. Had a flower, a uh, female, this morning. And we did pollinate her with the 2404 Baron. And this is the 1590, what is it? 1593 Schwartz. Okay, sorry, I just couldn't remember. I had it written down. And um, she has like a mess. This is the secondary. And who knows where the main is? And who, I have a protective cage around it and I can't move it now because all the vines are growing out of it so it is absolute chaos and mayhem going on in there and you know I really don't care um, I did kill all the quack grass over there I pulled up all the weeds out of here so I know there's a toad in there somewhere don't hurt my toad friend. And, um, you know, she's going to go where she wants to go. And she's going to do what she wants to do. And maybe she'll give me a pumpkin. Maybe not. It'll be interesting. It'll be interesting. Alright, here is my cucumbers. Right here. So you know, this is going to end up being a pumpkin trellis. It's just a what I think is going to happen. I got some apples. Okay. Anyway, it's my teeny tiny garden. I like to cram it all in one spot. And, um, there's the big girl up here. Alright. Well, hopefully everybody's tucked in. I'm going to close the gate up there and turn the water off and see you in the morning.